Dogs weak from not eating and living packed in filthy kennels. Their dead bodies found in a burn pit. Now this is the horror that animal control officers found at one local shelter. And now the owner is charged with animal cruelty. Channel 2's Brian Mims is live at the Heard County Animal Shelter. And Brian, these details, they are tough. But tonight you learned officers were able to rescue about 200 dogs. That's right, and some of those dogs are right here, but this is a small rural shelter, and most of the dogs have gone to bigger shelters in other counties. Some have been adopted. Just take a look at these guys. Heard County officials say this is one of the worst cases of animal abuse they have ever seen. These dogs are in a much better place. They're getting nourished, bathed, loved. Where they came from, they were getting hungry, filthy, sick. When animal control officers arrived at the Dogs Rock Animal Shelter, death loomed. A bird, they believe it was a buzzard, had swooped down and tried to take one of the puppies. Mm. And so our animal control folks intervened and kept the puppy from being taken off. Lieutenant Dan Boswell of the Heard County Sheriff's Office speaks of unspeakable conditions. Their kennels weren't clean, there was feces everywhere, food in the feces. They also found dogs long dead. We did find a burn pit out behind one of the barns. Mm -hmm. um, in the burn pit we found 24 skulls of various sizes of dogs and some of them we believe even had bullet holes in the in the skulls. And yet officers rescued more than 200 dogs rescued from a place billing itself as an animal rescue. The owner of Dogs Rock, Wendy Brewer, is charged with misdemeanor animal cruelty and abandonment. She's out of jail on bond. We went to her home and were told she wasn't there. You take your dog and multiply it by 200 and that's what we were having to do. Now look at how the community has responded. Heaps of dog food and dog cleaning supplies, all donated. Agencies from surrounding counties have taken in dozens of dogs, putting them up for adoption. We picked them up the other day. You could see the joy in their eyes that they were finally getting out of something and going someplace good. Brings a tear to your eye, doesn't it? It does. It does, because these dogs are helpless, and we were able to help them. Channel 2's Brian Mims back out live with us now. Brian, we know the owner is out of jail on misdemeanor charges, but the conditions you've shown us there, they are beyond bad. Could there be more charges pending? Deplorable. Aside from Heard County, there were 11 other agencies involved in this rescue. Lieutenant Boswell says the investigation is still going on, and there are likely to be more charges against Brewer. In fact, charges that are even more serious. He also says other people could face charges in this animal cruelty case. Sad conditions. Definitely sad conditions, but so great to see so many animals were rescued and how the community is stepping up to help. Brian Mims reporting live from Heard County. Thank you.